Joyce. Where is he? Where's my brother? They're taking him to the library. He might still be able to catch them. Sorry, that voice I know. You're with them. It's more complicated than. Look, I don't know if you can make it, but you should hurry. That's the first time you saw Beth Wilder. Yeah, but definitely not the first time she saw me. Will. Will! All right. No time to lose. I gotta get to Will. Well, before it's too late. Check out over there, then. It's supposed to take William, William Joyce, Joyce alive, alive if he doesn't put up a fight. fight. Please, please, let me go. Let me go. I can I shut, can the, shut hell the hell up. up. But just shut just the shut fuck up, up, all right? right? The boss said to take, take him to the library. Wants to deal, wants to deal with this with one first. first. Okay, then. Well, it's probably not good. Still alive. Gotta get to the library. That's where they're taking him. Yeah, sure. Get right on that. Gotta keep moving, Jack. Sense. Sense. Dragging this, Dragging asshole, this asshole, to asshole to the library? The library? Airlift's already initiated. Initiate. He should be gone by now. Airlift. The time machine. The time machine. You taking the time, the time machine? machine? Hey, hey. I said, I said don't talk. Don't talk. Well, I guess we go this way then. That can't be good, whatever that is over there. You still had no idea that Wilder was helping you? She wasn't the only one.
Alright, that's getting better. Three different ways down. Let's go with this one. get to the library. stuff here anyway. Why are you taking me here? It's a library. I need to return some fucking books. HQ, we've got William Joyce in the library. <coughs> Waiting orders. Over. Will, they took him to the library. I gotta find a way in. I gotta get to him fast. Personally, I'd say get the keys out of the trailer, get in the uh, earth mover there, and just make a new entrance, but... I need to get in that library. Well, 
looks like I'm not the only one with a grudge. It's gonna be a quiet night, but it sounds like things have taken a real bad turn down at the anti-monarch protest at Riverport University. I don't know exactly what's going on, but I've just heard about security personnel in the employee of Monarch Solutions detaining students, and some reports of gunfire. Now, I don't want to jump the gun here. This is unconfirmed, and obviously I don't know the details, but no matter how you slice it, it sounds like a bad scene. You know I'm not a big fan of Monarch or how they do things, but at the same time, I hope nobody's going overboard with this protest thing. It's just the goddamn building, people. It ain't worth anybody getting shot over. Although, if they are shooting people over it, that's some heinous bullshit right there. Either way, I've got a feeling this is gonna get a whole lot worse before it gets better. Stay safe, people. Well, someone else has been helping, because I didn't kill those guys. supposed to be going. That way. Probably one of those I'm missing something obvious scenarios. That looks like a way up. Sure enough, missing something obvious. <gasps> Come on, I don't have time for this. Gotta slow that thing down somehow. Yeah, slow it down. If only I had some kind of freaky time... controlling powers. Matters are contextual. Sure, that makes sense. This is Airlift Prime. We've got the Time Machine core in transit. Hey! Hands where I can see! Somebody was. What the hell is going on around here? Oh, 
fact. Library's ready to blow. Now? Get that whole uh, running thing the way I'm supposed to do, or that time dodge thing, but uh, yeah, anyway. Taking me here. It's a library. I need to return some fucking books. HQ, we've got William Joyce in the library. Awaiting orders. Over. Uh, well, that fully answered that question. Okay, Clara, thank you. Be right back. that five minutes isn't actually five minutes. Stay still to use the touch. Stay in the happy hands for ball. needs to be through it. whole new batch of messed up shit I need you to explain. Alright, where am I 
going? That way. Jack, I can't move here. Yeah, oh, oh, okay. We have to hurry. Where's my car? I didn't like the color. Let's get a new one. What? No, Jack, I need them. Uh. Hold that thought. My briefcase was in that car. I'll take you shopping. It's a fucking briefcase. A briefcase that contains something I need. And you didn't think to spell that out to me before. Yeah, well, it's not too late to leave you here. Messed up shit, I need explained. You got any theories about being able to manipulate time? No. Time to come up with one. No, no, no. Swapping out! Ah! Shooting! Get around him! They wanted to take us alive. I think they changed their minds. That would seem entirely probable. Yeah, I think so. All right. Thanks, Brother Will. We have to get to my briefcase. Then we find Beth Wilder. Why? Who is she? She knows about the fracture. I trust her. Glad you trusted somebody. It's not that simple, Jack. They kept secrets from you to keep you safe. Safe? Look around you, Will. Does this feel safe to you? This isn't my fault. Beth warned me this would happen. I did everything in my power to stop it. But you never told me any of this. I couldn't just... How long have you known? We don't have time for this now, Jack. We have to get to that briefcase. Let's move before more of them show up. Jack! Paul? Say that. Jack, we gotta go. Hold on. What are you doing? Only what's necessary. Think about this. You don't know what's at stake. I know exactly what's at stake. That's why I'm here. You believe you can stop what's coming? I'm giving you one chance to change your mind. This path, it's already said it can't be changed. The past, the future, uh, uh, I've seen it. I've lived it for 17 years. 17 years. It was you, the first experiment. Come with me and we can see this through. Or hold on to your hope and burn with it. Now listen, I built a device. I can stop this. I can. You can't. This is madness. There's no harm in trying. There is. That's why I can't risk you opposing me, Will. It doesn't have to end like this. We can't just let this happen. I'll never stop trying. It took me years to come to terms with what must be done. But we don't have years. Wait. Trigger. I never wanted this. No! 
My name is Paul Serene. I founded Monarch Solutions 17 years ago with a very clear purpose. There are those who would question my actions. I'm recording this as a final statement of vindication, a testimony of how things came to be. I've always been devoted to my mission. Never deterred from my goal, no matter the sacrifice. Because I've seen where this leads. I've seen where it all ends. We have a problem. No word from Jack Joyce's transport. It should have arrived here by now. We may have a traitor on the inside. You're due for your treatment. I'll find who's behind this. Find Jack. That's our priority. Get your best man on it. There's more. As you know, Jack's level of interference led to unexpected complications. Witnesses from the university were transported here. You need to take a look. We can't afford any further obstacles at this stage of the plan. Now, I see two options. We could use force, remove any loose ends. All right. If those witnesses disappear, then the public will start asking questions, potentially turn on Monarch. Narrative stuff here. Sir? Alternatively, I could mount a broad PR strategy, get the city on our All side. Clear, sir. But that leaves us with the, the loose ends. Precisely. The choice is yours, but keep in mind... Mr. Serene? The men will view your decision as a unified strategy moving forward. Sort of ominous. <laughs> I want this delivered to my office. What is it? A reminder. Then... I suggest we deal with the issue at hand. Liam Burke over there can explain the situation in more detail. Of course. How long until the Corps is ready for transport? It'll be en route to Monarch Headquarters in less than an hour. Installation should be complete before the gala. Good. Jack would never understand the necessity of what I'd done. It wasn't the death William deserved, but his knowledge posed too great a risk to our plan. Paul, the men are waiting for your input. All right, we're getting there. It was the first time I'd visited the Ground Zero operation in ages. The location I'd arrived in when I went 17 years back in time. 
the location where my fate was sealed six years ago. Sting? You hear about the library? Serene brought down the whole building just to take out that geek. Stone cold, man. <laughs> Talk about making a point. Shh, he's listening. We had Jack in custody, but I was starting to witness visions from the future which made it clear that could change very soon. It's training in the playhouse. Interesting. Well, they missed Cronon abilities a little bit. Sir, who is this? Amy Ferrero. She's one of the witnesses. Awaiting your orders on how to proceed. Good talk. Paul, there. we need your decision on how to proceed with the witnesses. My powers grew stronger, even as the Cronon Syndrome worsened. I could choose a path that would become the actual future. But it wasn't optional. The moment wouldn't end until I made up my mind. Interesting. Any potential threats to our plan need to be erased. Wait! Monarch would take a hardline approach. Crush all obstacles, eliminate all witnesses, it would be harsh. But I had made hard choices for the greater good before. I dug through the area and I found everything I could on your bro. This is messed up, man. I trusted Monarch. But the people of Riverport would turn against us. You murderer! Our secrets would be safe. But the public would hate us, and Jack would gain new allies. Monarch's got no authority to stop you, and you tell that to everybody on that bridge. Well, that plan kind of sucks. Let's see the PR option. Initialize a PR campaign. I want to sting you. And that violence was because of Jack Joyce. Monarch would take a PR-friendly approach and manipulate the public into siding with us. Our lies would give us control. The manhunt continues as authorities search for Jack Joyce. Hey, nobody's sneaking around down there. Hey, I think that's Jack Joyce! We'd use the media to expose, then hunt for Jack. I uploaded all the files I stole on that USB stick from the Monarch security station. But the eyewitnesses would be out there, and Jack would learn our secrets. I'm gonna go with the PR approach just as soon as this goes back to bed. Again. We're gonna go PR. We can't risk any unwanted attention. Convince the witnesses not to talk. Keep eyes on them and send them home. Initialize a PR campaign. We need the city on our side. Not this one. She's the head of the anti-monarch movement. I think we're looking at the new face of our campaign. There's no other way out. I'm going through the machine. Oh, wait. No! Jack! This way! Jack! I use my power to guide us. To decide how to best prepare for the inevitable end of time. 
That gives the chosen few a chance to survive. I've seen the end of time. Can't be good. <laughs> That's funny, actually. 